Hi everyone, it's Cast My Crunchy channel. Welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I'm going to be doing Toots and Previews for the semi finals for this week's games. Now, if you're returning Camp Smoke Pies, welcome if you're new to the channel. If you're new to the channel and watching this for the first time, like, comment, and subscribe. It means the world to me. Um, on the way to 200 subs. Um, as much as possible. So, now. Geelong versus the Giants in a big game for me. Um, if Geelong doesn't win this game... It's season over. Um, it's re rebuild time. Um, 20 finals have played, won six, lost 14. That tells you. The game plan does not stack up in finals, it's slow ball movement. I think with the way that the Cats play, they can play with the intensity to move the ball on. And I think that's the perfect way of going about this. I think we're going to see some teams struggling um, with that. But Geelong are definitely a tough team to beat. The Giants had a good win by a point. Um... Can they keep up this form without Toby Green, who I, I think deserves, deserves six weeks for what he does. Um, I, I think it's a wonderful thing that we're seeing that the Giants are in the semi-final spot. In what Toby Green did, it's unacceptable. Um, we have to make a stand. And the AFL appealing that as we speak, so I think that's what's going to happen. But... But it's interesting, you know, um, with this game. I think with Geelong... The, the, the purpose that I see, if they don't win, um, and they don't start well against the cat, against the Giants, um, they're in trouble. It's on a bigger ground, is it? So, so I think without Geelong, probably should be winning this game but I'm gonna pick the Giants and uh, I say about 17 points. Um Giants don't put tens to sword and we've seen that this year. Um but one thing we do know I think with the um the Giants are they're more talented than Geelong. Um Jeremy Cameron's playing against his other team starts off this week um have to start rebuilding and people think that they've got one or two years potentially more to get up towards the finals but I just think at the moment it's not going to happen too often um I think they have to be smarter than what they they do and actually start realising that the plans are going to the finals compared to anything else. Yeah, it hasn't worked. Um, you can't be up there forever. Um, Dogs chance realistically last year, and, you, and we think the same thing. Like Chris Scott's record home away is a lot good, but coming to finals like thirty nine percent and something like ridiculous, ridiculous low on that and I think that's how I see it like you gotta be smarter 
and you gotta really make a statement. So, I, I think with that, we're gonna see some changes. I feel, but for me, Giants by 17 points, I think that's gonna be an interesting battle. Um, if the Giants can play quick and and just force Geelong on the back foot, you get them early. I, I feel like you can as well. Um, the Gabba between the Brisbane Lions and the Western Bulldogs. Now, the Brisbane Lions coming off a disappointing loss to Melbourne, I think by over 30 points. Bulldogs had a smash and win against Essendon. Um, I think Brisbane will win this game. Um, mainly, it's at home. Having to travel from Tasmania up to the Gabba um, as much as possible. I think we'll see a better, probably, um, Brisbane Lions team. They'll regroup coming from Adelaide to, back to the Gabba at the home deck. In front of their f uh, enduring fans up there, and I think they'll get the job done by 20 points. Um, it's the only way how I can see it as well. So, they're my two picks. Um, have to check to see how many people pick the Giants and the Cats. But for me, 17 and, and, and 20 points. Um, that gets me wondering about that type of game where, of course, we're going to have to play well. So, for more... Um, AFL content coming out. So the the loser of these games, there will be a review of the season as well. Um, Sunday will be the the recap of the um, of the round. Um, on top of that, I think either way, it's been a success. I think um, from that, mainly because of, you know, the Bulldogs got through against Essendon and had to um, play Brisbane. Well, I think with Geelong, um, do I rate this to season a little bit more high if they lose this game because of the way that they played? Um, but... I think that we're going to have to be stronger at the contest. Oh, oh, I have to be strong enough to make these tough calls. But until then, like, comment, and subscribe means well to me. Um, and I'll see you back with another video. Um, I'm, I'm going to just have our right buggy at the moment. So might stream tonight if not i'll wait all right bye everyone.